A Boy Scout comes to the rescue of a family who nearly lost all hope. Yeah, that family lost a wallet with hundreds of dollars inside, but the Scout helped save the day. <laughs> Channel 2's Michael Laparty's live in Conroe tonight with the story. Michael? Chris, Dominique, we all know that dreaded feeling when you can't find your wallet. The scout's dad says he spoke with the family and they believe at some point they accidentally left that wallet somewhere outside their SUV, possibly on the hood. They'd started driving, didn't realize it, and at some point it fell off. Oh my God, I love y'all. Thank you. Oh my God, oh my God, let me call. That was the moment a father and son team came to the rescue, returning a missing wallet they found in Conroe. Just overjoyed, on the verge of crying. Um, we were excited that we were able to, to help out the family. Cameron Welch is a deputy U.S. Marshal, and his 12-year-old son Zane is a Boy Scout. They were heading home from a scout meeting on Monday night when they saw an SUV parked by their community. It looked like they really needed help. It looked like they needed help with what they were doing. It looked like something was wrong. Something was wrong. Cameron says the woman told him her husband accidentally left his wallet outside the vehicle while putting the kids inside. They heard a thump on the windshield while they were driving, but didn't connect the dots until it was too late. The family was retracing their route along this road when the Welches showed up. Zane and I jumped into action, and we drove down Crichton Road, and we were able to locate the wallet and bring it back to her. It took us under a minute. It was really quick. It was really easy to find it. Oh my God, I love y'all. Thank you. Oh my God, oh my God, let me call him. They found the wallet on the road with more than $700 inside. Cameron says the husband had just cashed his check and money was tight during COVID. For this scout, the big takeaway. Do a good deed daily could change people's life. <laughs> And Cameron says they were so caught up in the moment, they were able to get some pictures, but didn't end up getting that family's name. Zane says he did get a $20 reward and was also able to do his good deed for the day as part of his scout work. Reporting live tonight, Michael Loparty, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Do a good deed daily. Mm -hmm. I like that. Yep. Good.